In about three hours, the GW High School boys basketball team will face off on the court for a state championship. The school hasn't taken home the title in more than two decades. 10 News reporter Coulter Enstat was there for their celebratory send off in Danville this morning. We in love. Students lined the halls and cheered as the boys basketball team walked from the gym to the buses waiting to carry them to what they hope will be the school's first boys basketball state championship in 21 years. Forward Nyreek Wheeler was looking forward to the long ride to Richmond. I feel like it's, it's good for us, you know, so we can bond as um, brothers, you know. Shooting guard and small forward Shante Wilson says getting to the state championship game has been a community effort. We've seen, like, the community putting in to us, giving all that they can give, and us giving all that we can give on the court. So, yeah, it's, it's big for us. For head coach Jermaine Parker, this is about more than just a game. This would um, bring back that, that, that unity and, you know, with so much that was, was going on in, in the Danville community. And this right here is just to, you know, to get some focus back on, on GW and, and the players here at GW, some, some positivity because, you know, we hear a whole lot of um, negativity stuff, but, but there are some good things that are going on in Danville Public Schools. This right here, you know, I'm, I'm excited to be a part of. Um, just, to, just to take the guys to Richmond to, you know, to VCU to, uh, to, to win the championship. I'm not going to say attempt to win it, but we're going to win the cha championship. With the buses loaded, the team left the school, led by the lights <laughs> and sirens of a police escort to the city limit, and then from there, by the hope of a city desperate for a championship. In Danville, Colter Anstad, 10 News, working for you.